Hey guys and girls, my name is Snowy and welcome to part 5 of the Ring Road City of Valdez here in City Skylines in which we try to reproduce the you know uh, suggestion made by Jumble about creating a ring road around your city with different access points and then also make uh, exits and entrances from and to the uh, ring road around the city so in the previous episode we finished also off the train line going around here we build an extra station over here and we built also all these little niches of like industri industrial areas i said in the last episode i want to build one over here as you can see it's covered with trees naturally so let me uncover that with let me uncover the trees now I decided to put it actually here because I thought like nice and close to these people so they can go to work. I was planted, I was planning on putting it here but nah, I just thought like no let's not do it. So what are we going to do today? Uh, aside from, oh yeah, uh, before I say so, um, I put Central Park here. I used the Bob mod to uh, find out which tree was in here. It was an older tree, hey, how quaint, so I put some all the trees around it and actually there's a park in here which you cannot really see because of the trees ah so that's uh okay that's very smart so we, as you can see there's a park in here you know to draw in you know some visitors so a park around a park but the trees are little literally covering the you know the pathways well well that's a good way to go so let's put in a few more okay and yeah here's also on the parking lots and yeah well that will do fine for the time being and I put these two buildings in here which I thought like they he fit the team well the great mall of course is always good to put in there in this building called the generally which was not too expensive I thought not too big you know not not too obsessive you know good enough okay so I also said in the last episode we need now more res plus commercials and while I was busy with these uh, industry areas I also noticed that I forgot by the way <laughs> at one of these places a warehouse <laughs> so I put those there there and also there in the distance so that is sort of fixed now we're going to put like more residentials here and here great so how are we going to do that? Well, uh, we need for that a main street and I'm going to resume the game and we need a main road which will be this one. So we are going to drag this road that way and we take it from here that way. We're going to connect those up. Hey, <laughs> we love that, right? Connecting those things up. So we're using this thing, the connection tool between you and you. Boink. Always love that, you know, that uh, that kind of thing. Okay, then we are taking this road. We like this road. Now let's see what we can make here. Little jumpy game here and there, but that will do. And let's go over side here. Like that. And down here like that. I don't know, what is the distance? 22. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, rather have 21, but you cannot have everything. So, I will take it. So, we put this to there, and from there to there. You can always make a path in between here. No harm done. So, okay, here we go on further. To there. And let's see. From this road, we can make, you know, a little offshoot like that. Why not? Why not? Why not? And then let's bring it up from here and then make a bend from here oh that will be a three by a uh, impossible this is like a seven okay so we make this a four and three by three yeah that works okay so this area will be filled with uh, more residential and, and commercial and the same thing we will be doing over here as well now I'll, uh, yeah I can just use this road same road why not X 
except this time I will make it a 21 or 31. Nah, 31. 31 will do. I'll make it a 40. Go that way. Then a 10. Up to there. You know, keep it a little bit gritty here and there. Uh, and then also from here. I'm not sticking it to the main road yet. Always want to be careful with uh, too much traffic. And here we are going to do it sort of the same. 30 down. That's not that's not good. <laughs> uh, let's do this again. No, wait a second. From here, yeah, to there, there, and then from there to there. And from here. Yeah, we can make a nice curve from here. And then from here, what would that be? I think it would be a 4x5. It's a 5x6. I can live with that. Yeah, I can live with that. So these areas we can now fill up with uh, more residentials. Um, yeah, let's not wait with that. So let's fill that up. Um, and also... Um, Okay, these, these are already, already zoned, so I'm wondering what kind of, you know, residential options we are going to take, including the commercials. Now, I'm also thinking uh, we might be able to also use the middle section here, you know, to uh, put these metros out and, you know, and bring people in to the commercial zones inside. So, okay, I only need to worry about the commercial area over here. But what I also want to do is insert, you know, a, you know, sometimes a local IT cluster, a very small one, but still, yeah, residential specialization. I kind of like this stuff, you know, the self-sufficient buildings over here and the IT cluster, which will be then this one. Also put it here and we put it there and that's the wrong button. And here also the self-sufficient buildings over here in this region. Okay, let's make this area a little bit bigger, just a little bit smaller. Here we go, put that around there. It's all, all nice and well. And let me now zone up that place and let's see what we get. So, first of all, high density. And yeah, I always do mostly high density, but we can also put a little bit of low density here in front. Yeah. And then we put our single office block that will be a single IT building over there, which will do its thing. Okay, so you go there. Uh, this can actually all fill up, you know, without issues, like that. Uh, these guys can park there. So we are going to also utilize some paths. And as you can see on my money, you know, you see that it's still minus 8000 means like we are still not making any money and i checked last time before i exit the game like okay how much i am i'm in a minus i was like 400000 in a minus so i thought like uh oh let's not do that yet <laughs> let's just uh, wait with that for a moment so let's grab our simple school this one uh, which we can put like over here yeah and then is this an oh there's also an elementary school and we take a phoenix high school which will do nicely the job over there nice then we grab a few dog parks to make the people happier and we put that over here over there the two close to the road i don't know and maybe another one over here yeah. Now I don't know about. We do have. Let me see. Yeah, we have this one over here, which will go there and collect uh, dead people uh, if necessary. But we can always give them, a, you know, a little sauna. Yeah, you know, to just brighten these guys up. So uh, our residential demand has fin fin finished. Van vanished but still i'm going to implement them here because i know they will be built here we go so yeah good enough for me here we go put like that and 
see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. School also required here. So we put like this school over there. And this little one over there. Yeah. Perfect. And then we go here. Police department. I kind of like this little one. Although we have one over there, but let's just put one also over there. Yeah, let's do the same over here so they have a little bit of a stretch yeah just like that they like it they like it healthcare ah uh, yeah very important healthcare this kind of you know um medical clinic or this one i don't know what the difference is between these two but yeah what is the community pool it's mm, too expensive sports and hall 1500 a week Okay, let's put this one over there in the middle and then this one also here semi in the middle and then we are going to create like pedestrian bridges over here as you also can see that uh, the lot in the game already has well pretty improved uh, as if i say so myself so what we are going to do here and i want to do something different to to make sort of an I don't know statement make to bring this up six to the other side there 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 okay um how can i make this uh thinking if i turn this off this option and then bring it just down to the point there poof. and here we do the same just like that poof. and from here Ching, and from there, kaching. Hey, that's lovely, isn't it? I like it. Yeah, I really like it. Okay, let me also make a crossing from there to there, so they can walk from yeah, that point to that point, and here, mm, mm, from there to there, and of course they can walk to this uh, this area without actually doing the crossing here that is actually not a bad idea and actually no i no 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 i don't want to go underground underground is always tricky so we take this five u six to the other side and five u down and in principle that should be enough because the people who walk here can walk over there and they cannot walk towards that road Ooh, okay yeah, that's true so can i can i do something to make them walk from uh, uh, from there to there yeah and here actually the same right here yeah. <laughs> and from there to there okay and anyway i want to disable these uh, crossings so you can carry on you can carry on no crossings no crossings no crossings no crossings yeah and also use the move and mod this thing by the way to select this note this note uh, this note and this note just tab it one up like that right so as you can see we already um, even not playing on full speed but they are building they are building even if there's no demand so they have commercial uh, needs um the question is now are we going to put those commercial mostly here behind this uh, station that is something yeah the, you know the high density commercial I, li I really like that idea because we have the university over here so that is something we can do yeah so we grab this road is this a six lane or the that's a four lane okay these are all four lanes which is enough I think yeah okay so let me do an estimated guess. How far is this? Let me see. Ah, okay. That's not bad. Just put it there, yeah. Right, so now, now I have to think a little bit because commercials, also we have them here at these guys and actually, yeah, I said here more commercials plus calm as you can see so in theory i should place some commercials over here as well uh okay so a few minor commercials then 
at least that these people do not complain too much and also here the same thing these guys can supply these commercial buildings so that's perfectly fine actually there and there yeah and they will fill up unless I forgot something maybe a fire station there's a police thing fire station no fire stations here oh we take this building yeah oh yeah 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 they like it okay okay fair enough fair enough and here the same thing you go there in the middle right oh look at this this is like a fire hazard waiting to happen maybe no less no not really okay maybe the angel fire station that's a uh, somewhat larger let's hope that that will yeah that will help look at all these parking lots they are completely chuck a block full Ooh, and also covered with trees <laughs> okay no not covered with trees oh no they, they are indigenous to the trees Ah, okay sometimes you on you know you cannot be sure you know whether a tree is part of a building or part like here of a road for example so we will ban parking here and we take this parking lot we put it there 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 and there you can never have enough of those uh, yeah as you can see I put a metro station here also in you know in between so I will just show you what I did. I just connected up to the, the central, you know, tarantula thing over there. And now we have like two metros. And eventually, as you can see now, what is happening is like we are going to branch them to all these places. Yeah. But this area, this area would be nice for having heavier commercials. We already have like sort of the Grand Mall over there. So we can put it behind here or in between here. I am not so sure yet. You know, this would also be an, a very nice place for having a music festival just in the middle of the city. I mean, how, how, how much better would you love it to get it? You know, it's like, oh my gosh, I am, I'm so in lack of time with this game currently right now. It's, it's, uh, yeah, <laughs> frustrating because I want to do so much. <laughs> okay, let's uh, continue. So from there, 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 there. How much is that? There and there, and then we delete that road again. And this road, uh, so let me see where we're going to take this. Uh, we do not connect it, no. We're going to put it from here to there, and from there to there. So we can put a high density commercial over here with all this stuff, but not on the main road. Because on the main road, we will be putting parking. Parking there, parking there, 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 and there. And the means, of course, for people to get from the station. I, I think they can get out of here on the back, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, it's, it, it's something I need to see. So let's just grab this thing, this thing, and let's see how far we can... I don't know, there's a pillar there. I am not sure, guys. Hmm. Well, we put that through there, one. Uh, and I want to put also one between here. Okay, is that possible? Yeah, yeah, thank you. Come on. Uh, sorry for your building. Sorry. Sorry. And then we grab this thing, the note controller, and we point down. Thank you. A crossing there and we take this note and we change that also into a crossing perfect means like that we can remove these crossings you go you go and you go uh, also you go because you can cross also there which is fine Ooh, tall building there and here we do the same thing like that and that so we basically avoid these guys from, you know, crossing unnecessary. And we can use, of course, also the lane connectors to optimize the, you know, the road they are going, going in. As long as there is a node available for, for them to change. That's always a thing to take into account. So 
this case I think there is a note yeah there's a note okay we will leave it at that and here we can do the same thing so you will go there there perfect now I want to connect this up to that main station over there at least people can walk from from the station yeah to this side now whether they can do it out of this station I have no idea I want I still want to try it you know I still want to know just by just pushing it in there and just see what happens I have no idea it's something we I don't know guess I we have to see it for ourselves but as of now we don't have any um, uh, active train lines no because I let them all out but what we can do is for example this is um, the central station we can for example here build a yeah another station and the nice thing is that you guys yes you're gonna love this because we also have the green sunken train station also with no noise that makes them happy and let's also give these guys the same treatment uh, let me see from that there yeah and where are we going to put this one here on the other side oh yeah we are going to love that so we are grabbing the train line uh, we're going underground we connect it up you can you can you can you cannot see it but you can feel it that it's it's snapping you see that uh, the only thing I need to do is turn on the snapping tools here and you only have to bring it down even further what kind of line is that oh that's already a train line at minus 24 ah okay gotcha 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 so to work around that problem how far is this 22 okay so normally I would say then 24 would bring all the way to minus 36 then I would bring it now down to yeah, that's, this sucks it, it just does not want to play ball okay then in that case we move this slightly a little bit further to the sides that way so we have a little bit more le leeway Lee 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 Leeway, you know Leeway. <laughs> okay, you connect up to there. So we dive down to minus 24, and then from here again we dive to minus 36 to get underneath this train line here. And also we need to go under that one, and under that one. No, uh, under that one, that one. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of train lines. Okay fair and square so we have to depart from here go down to minus 12 uh, this goes this is going to be a pain in the uh, proverbial butt because you know I cannot make it go down that aye, aye. that's kind of sucks um, okay let me see let me see let me see uh, okay pause again we bulldoze this, 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 and this. Uh, yeah. Then we take the line from here. This is at minus 24. And we just make this just a little bit longer. Just like that. Yeah. It, this line is totally not connected to anything yet. So here we can make it 20 by 20. And the only thing that I'm just doing is I'm just, you know replacing it a little bit yeah that's it just replacing it a little bit yeah no problem and we are doing the connection tool from there to there da, 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 da. here we go enter done now see, i i do see sometimes players that they uh they seem to know care about uh, you know whether lines do con you know touch each other but I'm not one of those. I, I do want to actually not make these lines touch each other. Minus 24. Now this thing has to go down to minus 36. Kajing! And that will go under there. And that has to go to that line over there, which will be fun. Yay, fun. So from here to there. 
and actually it can make us uh, our first real train lines. Uh, is that? I think it's a little bit, yeah, too far away yet. So it's okay. Oh, come on, game. Work with me for a moment. Can I get it? Yeah, thank you. And you go to there. Nice. Now let us grab the line tool and say like, create new line from there. Oh man, this map is going to be glorious. Uh, where was it? It was here. Stop. From there to there. Complete line. Those are happy people. Nice. Now this one also needs to be connected to. Uh, we can also get out of the other out of the other side. I mean, we're not bound to uh, this side per se. Mm, if we want, we can make a direct corner around here. Yeah, we can do. We can definitely do. We can, let's say, let's see, we have to take this, first we have to dive down, Ooh, come on, come on game, come on, come on, work with me, to minus 12, yeah, and then we directly make a corner of 15 by 15 to minus 24, that's minus 24 for you. And then there's that station over there, here, and this is an existing line, yeah. Okay, so here we need to dive also to minus 36, I think so. So minus 24 here, and then here we do a minus 36, and then it will not touch that one. And here we go up again to minus 24, because the other part is also at minus 24. That other part is there. Yeah. Here we go. Look at that. Practical perfect. 17 by 18. What do you want more? Yeah, I like it. So from there, we can also travel to there and back. Yeah. Okay, look at that. How nice. So, these guys, yeah, they have now more opportunity to roam around. And what I'm also going to find now is that bigger parking lot that I used uh, before in, I think, Boomtown. Yeah, to, uh, where is that big? Is it this one? Oh, yeah, that's the big boy. <laughs> oh, that makes them happy. Especially near a station. There. There you go. And we do the same thing over here. Where did I put the station? Oh, there. Yeah. There. You go there. And you can also park there. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, these guys are also somewhat unhappy. So I will give them, I don't know, a new, uh, you know, just a little park. Here you go. Not happy? What? Oh, now you're happy. <laughs> hey, that's great. Look how, how this is developing. Great. So we have now residential here, plus uh, some commercial here as well. And here we are building up the, oh yeah, the massive. Oh, look at all those cars parked there. Oh, oh, look, oh, yeah, look, look, look. It's working. It's actually working. They, they make use of that. Oh, I'm so happy with that. Okay, let me see here. The carriers might... At the carriage, the cars might carry through, yeah, through the junction. And, yeah, I wonder where, why I put this thing there. Hmm. Well, <laughs> I have no idea, to be honest. Um, mm, yeah, that's a good question. This, uh, this one. Now these will also will probably go underground and I have no valid reason to think about other other than just maybe put parking lots there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sometimes you make these choices in the game and then afterwards you think like, huh? Uh, where is that crossing here? Let me put it there. One there. There. Uh, 
there and there yeah I mean it's it's the station right I mean that thing just needs like you know solid attention yeah great so we have all like this commercial area over here um, now also thinking we are producing here and here and here you know all these little pockets and we have this train line running around the island but since the big commercial is over here we actually would need also a train station over here that can collect the goods <sighs> so what that does mean is like we need uh, again a thing like this basically um, yeah the closest space the closest area would be roughly here Mm, or here this is connected to a yeah uh, yeah it's a little bit difficult um, you want it to be as close by as possible and this line is as close by as possible so that means like if I want to do it here mm, then I need definitely more land yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's no escaping yeah it's no escape because look at this if we are clicking this thing and uh, where is that thing here look the size of this thing of course I can create an ordinary V like some people do but nah look this is it you know it sticks out like at least that that far so okay we know what to do uh, we need to cause flooding <laughs> Uh, okay, so we take this thing, okay, well, so be it, I mean, um, that's part of the game, okay, let's hope that I don't uh, disturb any, uh, you know, lines, no, I don't think so, I don't think so, Okay, let's pause the game, and this has to go, uh, the nasty thing is, is that actually the, uh, um, the junction has to face to the other way, that's the nasty thing, but here we go, um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, okay, that water needs to evaporate, Where's that shipping line? Let me check out the shipping line because I need, I think I need a little bit more space on this one. Mm, shipping line is over there all the way. Oh, okay. So we can, we can steal a little bit more land. Okay. Fair enough. So we are going to, sorry, sorry game. Sorry. I, you know, I know you hate me for doing this. Also you keyball. I don't blame you. You guys are in all your rights, you know, in everything. You will be, you know, commemorated as be he being heroes. 10 by 10. Here we go. Here we go. And here we go. We grab you and we say to this whole key wall, like, okay, thank you. You are at the same height as that road. That's okay. And then this. Zoop. Flip it around. We'll do it like this. Thank you. And here we select in the unified UI mod the network model tool and we turn that thing around. Play it again. Okay. Yeah, just like that. It seems like as if the, the the heights are not the same, so I'm going to take this all and I align it to the same height as this. If there is any con any um, it's like you know this is lower for some reason. Don't worry, it will be fine. Yeah, there's some water spillage over here, but we will manage. Uh, okay, let's do also this part, and then from here. I say like, can we make a band of 18 by 18, no, I think we need a little bit further, I think 20, 20 by 
20 and then we take that uh, junction which is this one we snap it onto there that's great we go back here and then this has to connect to there in a orderly manner Hopefully. <laughs> Okay, we select this. Can we do it? Use this tool or not? Or are we then crossing again boundaries? I don't know. From here to there. Let's see. I think I think we can get away with it. I think we can get away with it, guys. Sort of. I think it might. So we still a little bit of land here and there more. And here, I don't know what is happening here. I think this, yeah, this piece is a little bit elevated. That's okay. We can bring it to Terraforma. And that's fine, yeah. So that is now connected to this line. Means like that finally we can utilize this now to go to this area. So what we need here is a station, uh, a cargo station, but not just a station, you know, it must be a station that is localized on a road that has the space to actually soak up the traffic. Uh, means like um, something like this, uh, 20. Now this is going to be elaborate, but interesting, six. Also noticing that I am going from the wrong direction but that's okay I can just flip it around that's 12 that's 12 okay so we make this also a 12 this goes down and then this is oh this is at the same uh, okay we need to fix this fix this uh, we need to fix like the whole map it goes down from here to here, that's for sure. Then it goes down to not the middle section. This is the middle section officially, but I keep away a little bit from it. So I will go from here, that's 6U to there. We go away. Then we flip, 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 and flip that around. We take it again. How far is this? 8U. 8U down there and down there. Great. Now. And now we're getting the train station, oh, this one, and oh, it just fits. That's wunderbar. And then this thing, we connect basically up to the, where's the thing? Over here. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Can, ooh, 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 this is, uh, okay. How are we going to do that? Can we get over that? Oh, I don't think so. Uh, okay, then we go under. We have the space to go under, so... Yeah, 12. And then minus 24 again. Here we go. And where is that other train station? It's over there. And this is also at minus 24. Okay, so then we bring this up to there. And then from here, we have to bring it up to minus 12. There's nothing to do about that. Minus 12. Yeah. Uh, and then here, how far can we go before putting it down? Only at minus 11U, but that will do. And I think we can just connect these two up without any hiccups and you will go to you it's a 9 by 11 but it's doable great now let's take this road because it's facing the wrong direction um, okay so let's grab this you you and you so they will now basically drive around they will receive the stuff from uh, at least from, no, not from this area, but from 
outside of this area uh, from here and eventually um, well these guys can always drive their stuff to these regions and yeah eventually you know I can I will make roads that will also go to here you know uh, there are more than enough uh, opportunities and what I also want to put here is like very important for these guys very important it's like the warehouses yes it's definitely the better these big boys they don't fit sadly enough and these are way too big um, how about one of these others maybe these maybe no even bigger these would do hmm one and on this side also oh that's too that's not the same size ah okay well maybe one is enough we fill that up with commercial zone goods like that perfect then we are going to uh, ban the parking we're going to speed up the game speed to 60 here uh, and for the rest I would say it's a cargo station so they need a little bit of parking there and there there and there it's always nice to have that uh, and for the rest um yeah what can I do here we can put like a few uh, more heavy commercials around here you know people can go there and also here we can put a few you know what on, on these crossings you can always put like an office block on the crossings to avoid uh, heavy traffic I mean that really helps that really 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 helps offices there and yeah I think uh, I think we have done a pretty nice job right now like this so what is up in the next episode well the demands are relatively low and we are still in the red you know with the weekly income and to my knowledge I did not forget anything in the budget so if I look here the budget everything is 12 percent and I'm looking at industries well the thing is we don't have industries yet and that's the whole point that's why we are bleeding money so I think in the next episode yeah we're going to focus on this oil area this oil area will be our um, yeah our money making machine so I'm going to, to dezone this well, uh, deforest this area a little bit and say already like um, let's get out of here Let's click this button and let's paint the industry area because we this is going to be our oil area for episode 6. And we love good oil. And oil is always like something that uh, brings in a lot of big muli muli man <laughs> muli money <laughs> money mula. <laughs> uh, so how are we going to call this? Um, well, this is just a Valdez oil. Not to think of it, uh, Valdez, was that not the name of a ship that was wrecked somehow? I, I'm not 100% a history, history buff, but uh, maybe you guys know it. But anyway, thank you for watching this episode number 5 uh, on this, um, well, the city with the ring road around it. Based on Yumble's uh, suggestion and just uh, let's see how it goes. 88% still nice on traffic we have a little bit of traffic over here but and here which is fine I mean it's running it's running it's running and that would despawn mode off you know nothing to complain yeah so that uh, yeah that still runs fine and we will also expand in all other direction but in the next episode we will definitely yeah go for the oil area okay guys guys and girls thank you for watching in the next episode we will gr put this number into the green because we need to earn money because i want to get rid of the unlimited uh, money option because you know it starts to uh, annoy me a little bit so okay guys and girls thank you for watching and until next time see you bye bye